like for you? You've been with this team obviously since last year, but had only appeared with T2. Um, what was it like for you to get this opportunity to start? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm truly blessed to get a start. Obviously, I was very excited, decided to get um, the debut on the, on the first MLS game, and you know, uh, I, was, I had no. Like I said, I was just very excited to get in, to get into the game. Um, you obviously, you know, there didn't seem to be that many jitters. You made MLS Team of the Week. How did you maintain the right focus uh, to put in the good performance? Obviously, um, well, during the game, I went I went in with the right mentality and the right um, the right uh, like what can I say um, the right uh, right mentality and went in with excitement and to play with the team and to also make my debut and to, to battle with the boys and you know defend defend a lot and you know work hard for one work hard for the teammates and uh, you know that I think I you know did pretty well defending wise and um helping out the team. When, when did the coach let you know that you'd be starting and did you you have to kind of switch something on when when you realize that you're gonna be playing um, football? It was I think it was during training I, I just saw that I was you know I was gonna I was into the starting eleven and you know I when I First, you know, noticed. Uh, you know, I just had to click and be in the right mode for the training sessions each day, and then taking it into the game. And you know, obviously, going to FC Dallas is a tough, tough game away. And you know, I'm so we're well, happy that to you know to get a point out of out of that game. And yes, yeah, so I was just excited to get into. It. Um, obviously, you might be a little new to Timbers fans. People are still getting to know you, but you played at a very High level, been with some big teams before. How has your experience? Uh... Um, I think it's helped a lot. You know, being in uh, in France and playing with you know some of the best players in the world and in, in France and having uh, international games as well. It's uh, I've got a bit of experience, but I'm st at the moment I'm still learning. I'm still you know trying to improve my game in each uh, in each aspects and of the game. And yeah. And I, I heard, I've seen a little bit that you, um, you obviously played well alongside Larry's, but I've heard that you guys have a pretty good relationship. Can you talk uh, about that? Maybe it's the French connection, but no, Larry's is, uh, he's, he's a great player. He's got, <coughs> he's got a lot of um, experience in him. He's got, you know, more than 200 professional games plus, and it's a, uh, you know, it's just so good to play against uh, next to him because he helps me a lot and communicates to me. So I guess it's that French connection there. Um, and you kind of entered the season. You know, there's a, there's a lot of players, uh, veteran players at centre back. How have you kept the right mentality through preseason to earn this opportunity? Uh, just you know, just watching you know Bridgie and and Larry's obviously you know, the two guys who have been in the in the professional environment for a very very long time, and learning off them just helps me a lot. And then I, you know, I can take that onto the field and improve my game as well. And what are the goals you kind of set for yourself after making your debut? Keep playing. Help the, help the teammates out improve throughout the year. And, and yeah.